or constructive rest. It is an invitation that I extend to you and you choose how you want to be. This is your process. And just allowing yourself to arrive. And you are empowered throughout this practice to do what you want to do or not do. Just a simple invitation of just coming to commune and connect with yourself. And I invite you just to allow yourself just to notice that you are breathing. Putting aside everything that may have occurred prior to and not rushing to get to the next few moments. Just being present right now, right here. As you breathe, notice the feeling of your breath. The coolness as you inhale, the warmness as you exhale. What is it telling you? And might this next hour be that of you just simply noticing and listening? Not only noticing and listening, but honoring. Honoring whatever it is that you need for this next hour. Not trying to define it or suppress it or analyze it, just be. For these next few moments of just Resting in silence. Just allow yourself to be embraced. Embraced, held, and supported. more breaths. And perhaps these are the deepest breaths that you've taken all day. Deeply inhaling, noticing the rise and fall of your stomach. 
and then deeply exhale. Noticing your back being supported. Deeply inhaling. Deeply exhaling. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, taking your hands overhead, stretching your legs out, just really, really stretching, almost as if not really waking up in the morning, but almost as if you're just taking in your day and just letting it go, stretching wide, maybe rotating your ankles, your wrists, opening up your fingers. And whatever it is that you need, even if it's rocking side to side, whatever it is, honor that. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, grabbing your elbows at the top, and then whether you go to the right or to the left, honor whatever your intuition tells you with your back still on the mat, just scooting over to your top body over to the left or the right, and then taking your feet in that direction for banana pose. Feeling that side stretch, ankles maybe crossed or not. Simple invitation that you have the right to accept or not. Breathing into that space, noticing your breath. And almost as if you can visualize your breath inhaling, coming in through the feet, up through the leg, through the hip, the side of the rib up through your underarm, all the way up to your elbow, out through your fingers. And then the exhale, all the way back down. Five more breaths here. And when you're ready, slowly releasing, coming back to center and extending the invitation to you to take that wide stretch again, maybe doing your arms a little bit wider and your legs a little bit wider, or taking your knees to your chest, it does not matter. Again, this is your practice, nice and easy. And if it's stillness that you need, stay right there. And at your own timing, when you're ready. Just going to the other side for banana pose on the other side, however you get there.
noticing that you are breathing. Mm -hmm. Just allowing yourself just to be. Your side may feel different, that's okay. When you're ready, only when you're ready, coming back to center and extending the invitation to you again to do whatever it is that you need, if it's a stretch or to take your knees to your chest or if it's stillness. Eventually, however you get there, we will come to hands and knees, but taking your time, however you get there. And if you want to pause in between, do just that. You may want to have a blanket underneath your knees. And for those that don't want to be on your hands, you certainly can be on your forearms to relieve some of that pressure off of your hands. And when you're ready, you know what to do intuitively. If it's cat, cow, if it's moving your hip side to side, if it's going around in circles, if it's stillness, whatever it is that you need, honor that. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, we're going to get inside our hips. So if you can see me, your hands are underneath your hands. We're going to bring our right leg forward. Left knee bent. The hands are on the mat. So we're going to ease into this. It's an invitation for each day. So you can stay right here. You have the invitation to stay here. Or you can take that right foot and scoot it a little bit forward going into dragon. Breathing here. And again, this is only an invitation. Placing whatever you need underneath your hands, blocks or a blanket. And breathe here, really getting into that hip. Five breaths. Breathe. Beautiful. And when you're ready, come back into runner's lunge. Beautiful. Breathe here if you need to be on blocks. Stretching that hamstring. Beautiful. Breathe. Breathe into that space. Three more breaths here. And when you're ready, just bring your hands forward and bring that knee back. Go back into balance. If you want to raise that right hip and do circles, that's fine. Breathe there. Beautiful. If you want to extend out that right leg. In fact, let's go ahead and do that. Extend that right leg out. Breathe. And maybe do your ankle and circles just to add some balance there. And extending the invitation for you to raise that left hand, extending it out. But again, it's just an invitation. Breathe here. 
And when you're ready, go ahead and lower that left hand down, right knee down. So if we did one side, we got to do the other. So taking that left knee forward, hands down, breathe here. The invitation is yours to stay right here. If you like, to, I'll send another invitation to move your left foot forward, going into dragon. And you're gonna feel it, it's a bit intense, but breathe through it. Breathe into that hip. Hands can be on blankets or blocks. Breathe. Five more breaths here. And when you're ready, just ease back into runner's lunge. Hands can be on blocks or a blanket. Breathing here. You'll feel this in your hamstring. The stretch there. Three breaths. Don't hold your breath. Unclench your jaw. And when you're ready, just bring your hands forward. Take that left knee back. And let's go ahead and extend that left leg out, rotating that ankle, breathing here, and extending an invitation to stay here, and also extending an invitation to raise that right hand forward, breathing here. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, go ahead and lower that right hand down, that left knee, and breathe. And when you're ready, go ahead and tuck the toes, our one downward facing dog of the evening. And you may want to take your time and walk the dog out. Knees can be bent. Beautiful. And when you're done with that, walking your feet to your hands or your hands to your feet or standing forward fold. Knees can be bent. And I invite you to either take ragdoll or to grab your hair, massage your scalp, whatever it is that you need. Breathing here, beautiful. And if you want to rock side to side, do just that. Yeah, if you want to stretch your shoulders, taking your hands behind your back, Lean the palms of your hands up towards the ceiling, whatever it is that you need. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, we're gonna to come to a halfway lift. Hands can be on the shins, knees, or thighs. Breathing here. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. And now we're going to come into chair. Burn a little bit of energy. Beautiful, beautiful chairs. 
Hands can be straight ahead, triad, or on your hips, whatever works for you. Breathe here, beautiful. Breathe, breathe deeply. You got this. Go ahead and forward fold, breathe. Halfway lift, forward fold. Coming back into chair. Let's see how deep you can go. Maybe a little bit deeper. Breathing here. Make sure that you can see your toes. Breathe. Now let's add some twist to this. We can go to the right, open twist or prayer twist. Beautiful. Breathe. Open twist or prayer twist. Coming back to the center. Go to the opposite side for the twist. Breathe here. You're gonna feel the energy, breathe. And when you're ready, go ahead and release. And when you're ready, stepping back in the downward facing dog. And if you'd like to take a flow here, that's fine, we'll eventually end up on our bellies. And just pause here. Breathe. Noticing your heart is beating, the rise and fall of your stomach against the earth. Just breathe deeply. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, taking your arms out to a T, and stop here. Noticing your palms against the earth. Feeling of the texture of the floor, the coolness of the floor or the warmness of the floor. Your breath may be a bit warm. Again, noticing the rise and fall of your stomach against the earth, the rise and fall of your hips. And when you're ready, only with you when you're ready. Starting on our right side, you just want to roll over with your hips stacked, stretching out that shoulder. You may want to place something underneath your head if need be. And if this is a bit intense in terms of the shoulder, you can always lower it down just a little bit. It's just an invitation. Using your hand as a kickstand or you can take the opposite hand behind for a bind. Just breathe here. Opening up that shoulder. Three more breaths here. And when you're ready, coming back to center, taking your time. And just pause here. You may want to shake your hips side to side.
And when you're ready, only when you're ready, just going to the opposite side in your own timing. Again, extending that opposite arm out, the left arm out, and you have the option of taking a bind or not. Legs can be straight or they can be bent. Breathe in here. Five more And when you're ready, coming back to center. And pause here. Breathing in deeply through your nose. Exhaling out through your stomach. Breathing in through your nose. Exhaling out through your stomach. Almost as visualizing a circle as you inhale through your nose, it travels down to your stomach. Exhaling out through your navel center. Breath being restored by the earth, giving you all the nourishment that you need. And you inhale in. Right where you're at, go ahead and raise that right knee in line with your right hip for a half frog. Breathe here. Inviting you to breathe into that hip. Arms can be any way that you'd like for them to be. And you have the invitation to stay right here, but if you'd like to in that leg, that is an invitation to you as well. Yours for the choosing. Breathe. 
And when you're ready, only when you're ready, extending the right leg back with the left. And I invite you to bend your knees and almost do like a windshield wiper, just back and forth. Yeah. Any way that you want. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, go ahead and come back to center. And lifting the left knee aligned with the left hip or half frog on the other side. Arm can be any variation that you like. Next to you, underneath your hips, whatever it is that you need. And you have the invitation of staying right here, but extending an invitation to you to extend that leg out if you like. Breathing here. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, extending that left leg back with the right. And we're going to pause here just for a few minutes. Just laying still. Allowing yourself to be fully held, fully supported. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, taking your elbows underneath your shoulders. And 
coming into sphinx pose or not if you just want to lay still <laughs> do just that and i invite you to do intuitively what you'd like to do if it's moving your head up and down Making sure that your eyes are soft, your jaw is soft. If it's taking your hands to either side for the side body stretch, I invite you to also partake of that if you so choose. Just breathing here. And when you're done with this, and you'll know when you're done, I invite you just to take the next few moments to begin to prepare your nest for yoga nidra. And allow Shade to serenade us, get us comfortable. And once you get there, just to allow yourself to arrive, to get settled, to make whatever adjustments that you need. Making sure that you're taking care of the tender spots, the back of the head, the lower back, the knees. Maybe even the soles of the feet. Taking these next three or four minutes just to listen to what it is that you need. Notice that you are breathing. And knowing that, again, this is your practice and you are empowered to adjust or Stop as you need. Because ultimately, you know when it's best for you. So as we move into stillness and as you are ready, eyes may be gently closed or partially open with a soft gaze. You're invited to say mentally, my yoga nidra practice is beginning. Now is my time to take care of myself. Feel your body settle. Feel the support beneath you.
feel how your body is in contact with the support beneath you. The right foot. The left foot. The right leg. The left leg. Right arm. Left arm trunk of the body, back of the head. Feel the whole body being supported. Taking a deep inhale in, and then exhaling out. Do that one more time. Deep inhale in. Exhale out. And as you return back to your natural rhythm of breathing, Begin to allow yourself to let go. Simply let go. Feeling the flow of your unique breath in and out of your body. Feeling the body receive the care and rest with the inhale. And with the exhale, feeling the body releasing more, more and more into that hold of care and that of rest. Inhaling that of care and rest. Exhaling deeper and deeper into that hold of care and rest. Allowing yourself to be fully held, fully supported. Breathe, Kendra. Just breathe. As you breathe, fully releasing into the support beneath you, fully at ease. relaxed.
You are held and you are supported. Now feel a warm, glowing light starting at the right hand, thumb, index finger, middle finger, ring finger, little finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand wrist, lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, right side of the trunk, right hip, thigh, knee, lower leg, ankle, right big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe, a warm glowing light at the left hand, thumb, index finger, middle finger, ring finger, little finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, left side of the trunk, left hip, thigh, knee, lower leg, ankle, left big toe, second toe, third toe, 
fourth toe, fifth toe. A warm glowing light at the top of the head, forehead, right eye, left eye, right cheek, left cheek. Nose, lips, tongue, jaw, front of the neck, right collarbone, left collarbone, hollow between, right chest, left chest, heart center, deep within the heart, upper abdomen, navel center, lower abdomen, pelvis, womb, buttocks, Lower back, middle back, upper back, whole spine, back of the head, top of the head, a warm glowing light on the whole right leg the whole left leg, whole right arm, whole left arm, trunk, neck, head, a warm glowing light on both legs, both arms, trunk, neck and head, a warm glowing light on the whole body, the whole body, the whole body. Feel the whole body releasing and letting go deeper and deeper into the embrace of care and rest. Allowing yourself to be deeply embraced, deeply held, and deeply supported. Feeling encircled by this warm glowing light of care and rest. This warm glowing light surrounding you, embracing you with care and rest. Now, with this feeling of 
being embraced by this warm glowing light. Allow yourself to bring these feelings back with you, that they may remain with you to sustain and keep you. Bring your awareness to sound. Listen to the sound of your breath. Listen for the sound closest to you. Listen for the sounds furthest from you. Notice your body in the space. Notice what is touching your body, the air against your skin, the fabric against your skin, the support beneath you. Be aware of your entire body. Your entire body from head to toe. Breathing more deeply into and out of your body. Invited to say mentally, the practice is now complete. The practice is now complete. Introducing whatever feels natural to your rising, beginning to move. Perhaps starting with your feet, your hands, letting movement spread through your whole body and when you're ready only when you're ready the invitation of staying right where you're at or coming to your side and pausing there. Taking your time. ready, we'll eventually come to a seated position. Simply closing our practice placing our left hand on top of our heart and our right on top of our left. Just taking a moment to acknowledge breath and life and gratitude for that. Gratitude for these practices that allow us to come back to center gratitude for this beautiful community.
May you be happy and peaceful. May you be strong and healthy. May you be confident and courageous. May you be safe and protected. May you be at ease with yourself just as you are, leaving nothing out. The light in me sees the light in you. So grateful for each of you. Namaste. Now, I'm going to take you off mute, my mouse. <laughs> You guys have a wonderful weekend. Thank you. That was lovely. Oh, thank, thank you so you. much. Thank you for teaching, Danielle. Oh, of course. I love it. <laughs> y'all know I love y'all. So <laughs> it's so good to see you faces. So like I always say, make sure that you take care of yourself this week, even if it's just for a pause, breathe, stop, and just um, just take care. All right, just just really take care. All right, thank be you. well. Be well. <laughs> Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.